Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of State of Decay. Alright, when we left off, we had uh, been dealing with a lot of stuff. We had uh, had a important member of our party die. And Let's we have these people sitting here you coming? asking to help clear out an infestation. And fuck it, why not? Are you kidding me? I was ready before it was cool, man. <laughs> ready before it was cool. Okay. Why was that locked? Why in hell's bells was that locked? Oh well. Yeah, let's just get this one moving towards that spot. It sounds like there's a big one. At least it did a couple seconds ago. Come on, get off my vehicle. Okay. Jeez. I have no idea why it took that long. Anyway. Infestation's over this way. I think it might have been near that one building that we avoided before. Yeah, I think it is. Okay. Oh, there's an actual horde. Uh, coming from that direction. Oh shit. Oh shit, there's a bloater. That's not a good thing at all. Frame rate's kind of dying on me. Okay. That helps a little. But I'm not letting that bloater get any closer than it has to. So, there we go. Got that. And now we're going to head to the building and get the zombies out of there. Because it helped the whole community. Ready. Let's get some more bullets in here. There we go. What the? Oh, they're banging on the door. Okay, I was wondering what the hell the sound was. Okay, they'll eventually break themselves out, I think. Yep. Yep, I'll let them take care of some of them. And I'll just swing around a little bit. Oh. Come on, damn it. Let's get a snack in here so I can fight a lot more effectively. Come on, damn it. Let's take out the streamer. God damn it. Fucking screamers, man. They're always more difficult to kill. Let's take out the screamer. Now we got this one to deal with. Okay. Now there's still a lot of zombies coming around because there was a lot around us. And the screamer alerted a lot of them. But, at least we can deal with them now. Because we're no longer trapped in the building doing this. Yeah, keep it up. Jesus, god damn it. Take your damn lumps. We got paid for our trouble in healing supplies, which is always in short supply around here. I'm gonna see if we can collect any stuff out of here. Hopefully we can collect a new heavy weapon because we have very little this is good, right? choices I mean, in that regard, but that is really helpful that I just picked that up. There's a lot of them around though. This one's wandered in right behind me. And down you go, motherfucker. Why are you not doing the thing? Okay, there. That was weird. 50 caliber rounds. Why is there 50 caliber the rounds in guy. here? We've got the basics, but to okay. really pull this off, we need a little more. We can track it down, or find another way. But it'd be faster if you did a little scavenger hunt. Alright, I think this is for the storage area that I had planned on get it, um, making up uh, off camera. Sit tight. But then it Bring ended up being home. a thing I was doing we'll be uh, a little bit before recording. Because... 
once you get home, you'll you probably saw it before I left, but you realize our food and fuel is really, really, really overstocked. Uh, we could let's see. We could establish an outpost here, but it would not really be helpful. Oh, jeez, one of our guys got sick. Whoa, on second thought, hold off. This place isn't safe. Yeah, there's a lot of zombies around here. It's a lot more than I thought there'd be, even. The only downside to the heavy weapon is it's slow, but with Powerhouse on top of it, it makes it a very, very quick kill in most regards. And what I really should be doing is trying to find more survivors to join up with us. That'd be a lot more helpful. Wait. Oh, that's a uh, armored zombie. I'm like, wait. What else was coming around here? What other big motherfucker? Okay. We'll just ignore that car for now because that car is pretty much dying on its own. Don't know why I got transported to our house, but it is what it is. And... How's it going? Almost there. I'm almost there. Alrighty. Close the door. That's the last thing we need, an open door. We need a lot of supplies Don't say I for never building. Gave you anything. A, oh. Wasn't there supposed to be someone on guard? Fuck it. I guess I'll have to deal with it. Why is it not working? There we go. Jesus. I hate it when it does that. Alright. Where we were building our thing is right over here. One of the outside areas. And we have enough space for a little training area here but we do not have the materials to make it however the spot we found should be beneficial to that but first thing we need to do before we do anything is get some things done to help out uh... everyone else is pretty much out for right now and if I remember correctly, there's a stranger in trouble over this way. It's not that one. I'm already aware of that one. And besiege missions are kind of a bitch to deal with, so we're not going to be doing that. For right now. We might later uh, at another time. Okay, and it was all the way over here. So past the... Uh, little Burger King area here. Oh, you little shit. You're trying to sneak up on me. How dare you. Alright. Down you go, like a sack of hammers. Bitch. Okay. Let's reload this real quick. There we go. Okay. And they were at this area here. Now I understand why they were in trouble. Oh, this is another one of our bases. Yeah, I can tell. Break its fucking skull. Yep, doing that. Yep. Okay. Cover Julia. That helps them a little bit, and that helps them trust us a little more. It's always good. A little more trust in this sort of situation is always good. It's always a good thing to have. And nothing, are you kidding me? Motherfucker. What sort of things can we find around here? Well, it seems someone outside decided to uh, not have a this muffler good, on the right? car. I mean, it doesn't suck. No, it does not suck. It's another heavy weapon we can use. It's 
always a good thing. Well, at this point, it's always a good thing. <laughs> Since we have so few of them. We are set free here. Although, I really want an axe. The hammer is good, but I really want an axe. I always prefer the bladed heavy weapons. Feels more visceral. Okay. We're good here. Anything else where I can help people other than that goddamn besiege mission? Uh, Zed Hunt. Stranger in Trouble. There's a lot of things over there. Is there any vehicles I can take over here? Any, like, quick, easy vehicles? There's that. That'll be good. I'm on the move. I hear ya. Whoo, okay. Gotta love these vehicles. Classic muscle cars. Whoo! Really? That should not have caused me to stop like that at all. <sighs> Whatever. Okay. We are now going to head over to that stranger in trouble where I think is where uh, our other person died. Valiantly trying to help them. And, whoops, let's phase through the <laughs> engine there for a second. Uh, we're going to deal with that, bring back their stuff, and hopefully, it'll be better with Jacob, because he's our go-to Zed killer. Why did I say it like that? I don't even know. I'm half asleep, guys. I'm sorry if I get stupid, because <laughs> I've been having a little, some long nights recently. Okay. Uh, what we do is go this way. There we go. Jeffrey is scared. We're all scared, motherfucker. Calm your tits. Uh, yeah, it was an armor zombie. Okay. There we go. Okay. Whoo! Oh, fuck. There's that. Alright. We'll head down this way. Maybe this is going to be someone that will join our little team. Maybe. Hopefully. Considering we already lost a person trying to do this. Motherfucker. I'm already beating up my car. Come on, damn it. Quit swinging the wrong direction. Jesus. Alright, there's already some sort of issue over here. Let's see the minifin. Yeah, there's a whole lot of people over here. I have a feeling these guys will want to join the us. Wait a minute, there's a military I, person. Can I just go on the and, and say that that really sucked? <laughs> Fact is, we're never gonna last on our own. Not like you folks have. Not like a charity case or anything. We'll work. Hey, as long as you're willing to help out, I don't give a fuck. You guys can come right with me. Okay. Make that quick. Like ah! Good thing I made that quick. It'll pick up the rucksack. So tired. Okay, I'll run this home. We'll be ready. Yep, okay. That's up ahead. Yeah, that there is. This is only one. I feel I can do that without draining myself too much. And because we have two people instead of one, I'm just going to take this car back with me. Oop, this has a lot of power. I keep forgetting. A lot of power, more than it should. Oh, jeez. Why do I keep doing that? I always do that. I always pull that sort of stupid shit. And the uh, the fuck is with all that noise? Okay. Uh. There, there was this guy who lived on my street when I was a kid. 
Biker Steve, we used to call him. Okay. I don't know if he was actually a biker, or, or if his name was even Steve, come to think of it. Anyway, this crazy fuck, I swear, all he did was get drunk and pick fights. It didn't matter where, didn't matter with who. One time, he walks into a swine and bovine. He goes up to a table full of, I don't know, construction workers, long form, whatever. Big ass dudes. Steve, who weighs maybe 115 pounds, soaking wet, just starts going off on him. Just starts calling their wives ugly, calling their moms whores, just every horrible thing that you can think of. And then he tops the whole thing off with, and I, and I shit you not, and whoever your favorite football team is, they're a bunch of pussies. Oh, jeez. <laughs> they beat the shit out of him. Cops had to tase a couple of them just to pull him off. And Biker Steve, he's just grinning like an idiot the whole time. I wonder what the hell happened to that guy. I hope he's still out there somewhere. Just straight up picking fights with zombies for shits and giggles, you know? That would be kind of cool. I do like this new guy that we've brought on. I do like him. He seems pretty awesome. There you go. Okay, that's all we needed. That's good. We needed you guys quite a bit. Jesus, this car is fucking condemned as far as I'm concerned. New faces. And some of them might even be able to help. Let's look at them. Let's get a good look at them. Uh, Jos Josue? Josue? I don't even know how to pronounce that. He's a powerhouse too. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. We got another powerhouse in the group. Artillery support and a soldier. Oh my god. This was the best thing I could have done. <laughs> he's a friend and he's, he's gonna eventually be a friend. Uh, we need to work ourselves up to that. But this, this is a good thing to be having on us. Uh, we're pretty much at full on for powerhouses. For him, this guy's a pretty cool dude. Let's, let's look at him. Uh, thinker, look before you leap. Like to travel. I always figured I'd die somewhere exotic. Well, that ain't gonna happen now, is it? Storyteller. And he, he's my kind of guy. A uh, natural athlete and loved cycling. So his cardio is much improved. Awesome. 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 And this guy is sick. So, wherever the hell he is. I need to deal with that. Let's drop all of these here for now. Uh, including that. Let's see if we can get some more meds and whatnot in me. It says we have all this food, yet all I have is five snacks. The fuck, dude? Uh, okay. Well, I can put this improvised suppressor, improvised suppressor on my gun. That'll run the entire clip, but it's something. And I have no ammo, no extra ammo for this gun. I'm going to see how far I can run Jacob for right now. And I'm going to trade in this car for something else very fucking soon, because Jesus Christ. Oh, man. This is making all sorts of sounds that make me freak out when I'm driving. I already found some survivors. What survivors are you talking about? These ones? Is that what you're referring to? I'm not going to look into them. They're, they're going to get me killed. Lord knows we already got one person killed. We don't need to be killing me. I'm the good guy. I'm the awesome one. Gotta be a way out. Really? It's over there? It's over there. That's actually not that far away. Like the first time I did Breakdown and I had to do this, it was all the way in the fucking Ranger Station area where you first start out the game. That's not that far. Holy shit. Okay, I think we got a plan for next episode. <laughs> that is cool. Alright. Let's grab some of the stuff over here first. <laughs> there we go. Head over here. Yep. Got a zombie coming up on my six. 
Nothing else around by the look of it. It's no zombies reoccupied the place. Area secure. No Zeds here. Good. Uh, pry bar. Don't really need the pry bar. Really need the supplies that I found earlier. That's where they are. Okay, I'll run this home. Roger that. We'll be waiting. Yeah, you better be. Yep, oh, that's where this guy went. <coughs> There we go. All right. We got us a plan. We got us a plan for next episode. And we're doing pretty well now, considering how badly we were last episode. Oh, boy. There's another one coming up. Actually, let's just take him out now. Fuck him. Take the microphone stand into your face. Enjoy it, you bitch. Okay. <laughs> I'm starting to get a little too into this. Woo, okay. We'll head over here. Head back to our main base. Let's take out another zombie on the way. Because it never hurts to be taking out zombies. Oh shit, there's two of them here. There's more than I banked on. Oh, I took out that one. Just one swing. Okay. And I'm not entirely sure what gun How's the uh, trooper has. I'm almost there. We'll crack open a cold one for you. That's good. Whatever gun the trooper has is probably very, very strong. Why are you locked, you little shit? There we go. Okay, let's drop these in. I found this while I was out. All right. My hero. And I think. First, let's look at the housing situation. Uh, yeah, we can make up a training area right now. We could make up a training area. And eventually, when we get enough people, we need a good cook. Uh, the team mom was the cook. We lost them. Uh, well... Like I said, we have a plan, and we're going to act on that in the next episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more, and click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community and we can talk about the games we're playing together. And consider supporting me on Patreon. It'll be a link down in the description, or, you know, whatever. <laughs> it's completely optional. You do not need to do anything if you do not want to. I would just very much appreciate it myself. But you're not obligated in any way. Anyway, I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one, the only, Stray Cat, playing games for you.